Hi there, so in this video I'm going to discuss access modifiers in VB.NET class. Okay, so the first thing that we are going to do is open Visual Studio and create one VB.NET console application. And you will have empty solutions just this. Here I'm going to use class keyword and create an emo class. Inside which I'm going to use public keyword and create one variable as string and this variable will be public in nature for accessing through class then I'm going to use private variable h as byte okay now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use public function and I'm going to name it get h adds byte okay and this function will return the value of h okay and another function so let's name it set h okay and let's make it accept this by val h as byte okay so let's make it accept h and assign me dot h to h okay now inside our main subroutine I'm going to create one object as new and then animal okay now here I'm going to call for species and set its value to let's say dog okay and also I'm going to call for set age and here I'm going to set the age for dog as 3 okay and that value will go to this function and you will find that it shows me age equals to age okay so that being said once you set the age we are going to call for get age which will get that value 3 back okay so let's use console dot write and inside this I'm gonna use curly brackets and first get our dog value and then how many years old as the value then I'm gonna call ob1 dot species and then I'm gonna call for ob1 dot get age Okay, then I'm going to use console dot read. Okay, now we can execute this code and find out how old is our doc. Okay. So we can see that it says dog is three years old. Okay, now here as you can see our dog is set to public whereas its age is declared private. So accessing this age is only possible if we create instance of this animal class. 
we cannot access set edge and get edge directly because they are now part of this class animal okay and they being public will be only accessible through this class and this private is only accessible within the instance or you can say through object of our class okay so we have seen public and private access modifiers in vb.net